Hey everyone, quick question. What if your distro swapped its login screen? Well, Fedora 44 is doing just that. Fedora is said to be the first distribution to ship KDE's new Plasma Login Manager as the default. And yeah, that means goodbye SDDM for now. So here's the deal. Fedora 44 scheduled to release on April 14th, 2026 will ship Plasma Login Manager or PLM as the default login screen for all KDE variants. That replaces the long-time default SDDM. Neil Gompa, a Fedora contributor and KDE packager, proposed the change and Fedora's engineering council approved it. This switch will touch Fedora KDE Plasma Desktop Edition, the KDE Plasma Mobile Spin, Fedora Kinovite, and basically all KDE-based uh, Fedora labs since they inherit packages from the Desktop Edition. So it's not a tiny tweak, it's broad. PLM isn't just a new skin, it's being built to support multi-monitor setups, HDR virtual keyboards, full power management, and screen readers. So accessibility and modern hardware features are part of the plan. KDE aims to ship PLM alongside Plasma 6.6, .6, which is slated for February. Sounds promising, right? Now for the reality check. The PLM repo even warned it was in a prototype state. People raised concerns. Neil replied that the REA DME is out of date and PLM is considered good enough that Fedora is starting integration. He also said in, and this is important, if PLM ends up problematic before the time freeze, it's trivial to roll back to STDM. So Fedora has a fallback. If you don't use a custom login theme, you probably won't uh, notice much beyond a different looking login screen and some under the hood improvements. But, and this is a big but, if you do have a custom SDDM theme, you'll lose that functionality unless you switch back to SDDM. If you prefer your custom theme, you can reinstall or re-enable SDDM and set it as the default display manager. I'll link a quick guide in the description. My take, it's a bold move that lines Fedora up with KDE's recommended stack and modern display needs. There's some small risk while PLM matures, but Fedora seems ready to revert if anything breaks. For most users, it should be a smooth upgrade. For Thamers, it's something to watch. If you like this quick explainer, hit like, subscribe, and drop a comment. Are you excited for PLM or mourning your SDDM theme? I'll see you in the next one.